Oh, I want to get your guys' take on this new woman who has taken the internet by storm. Her oh. name is Lily. She is the it girl of Twitter right now. Some people think she's a Mossad spy or a psyop or a, the plant. a secret sneaky Jew here to <laughs> ruin our lives. Um, she's been on all the podcasts. She's making the rounds. Oh. Oh, Some no. have fallen in love with her because she's hot. Um, <laughs> yeah. Her name is Lily. She, she followed me back, so she, she gets a uh, point. She was following me, and and then I was like, well, I have to follow her back. That's how this Oh, goes. she followed you first. Whoa. No. Here we go. Italy. She okay. made the first move. Okay. Yeah, and I was like, Ooh, oh. Wow. wow. <laughs> she just had a reach around for me, but she went she went full on with you. That's yeah, good. and it made me feel yeah. a way. I was like, Yeah, oh, see? Ladies okay. like that. That's a little yeah, attention. We do. Her. We a like being bit. flirted with. It's true. <laughs> just a little bit. Just like, hey, I like you. Spy. She followed me first. That's fine. Exactly. Totally uh, but you really described her. her how many you L's does she have her in every name? way but the N word girl, which is what everyone's calling oh, her. Oh gosh, of course. Yes, the N word girl. Of course. How I, I forget? Oh, this is who that is. Okay. See? I still don't know yes. what happened. That's her. Well, she said the word and. <laughs> people not having kids you are some stupid motherfuckers out there the birth rate is declining oh, and what are you doing you're post. getting married like why even bother fucking getting married you loser you're getting married you have some fucking dog in a stroller like a faggot and then what are, <laughs> then what are you doing what are how are you helping america we're letting we're letting the birth rates decline and i'm speaking particularly to white people so today i want you to take the time out of your day to thank a single mom because us girls getting knocked up we're the only ones helping with the declining birth rate you're welcome america you're <laughs> fucking welcome god particularly you she's got moxie <laughs> and spunk she's sassy i like her no Let's no see, she's the, she's fake angry video? you think so <laughs> she's fake angry so? she's Oh yeah, she's trying so hard to like have that be her persona, and it's mm. inauthentic. Like she's, she's not actually mad the about new, the birth right, rate. You guys, didn't you see the picture? She's of not the mad new about the birth rate. She's in it, I did see no, that. I knew. Mad about the birth to the rate. top. That's the new right. It's oh, this Nico oh, and then middle, her and oh. some people we don't know. Oh. Yeah, that group photo. This is what they're passing around. Is this is the new right, everybody? And oh, I'm like, oh god, I I don't what? even know who half these people are. Yeah, I know that's what I'm Me saying. Like, okay, sure. Yeah, sure. She's this tall. is what we're up wow. against. <laughs> <laughs> this is I'm our competition, scared. guys. Are these, oh. Yeah, are these friends or foes? I don't know. <laughs> um, gosh. I saw so Owen where's Schroyer. The, where's the N word video? Are Owen Schroyer watch? interviewed yeah. her on InfoWars, and I, I could, he was really careful with the questions he was at because he was like, Tell me about your background. Tell me about where you were before you went viral. Tell me about like, what does your family think about uh, all this? And I, I noticed in the interview, she kept looking over to the side, which I thought was kind of sus. Like, it's not like she looked up because she was thinking about answering a question. She kept looking in the same direct i don't know if anybody in the chat saw okay. this interview but she kept looking in the same direction off camera for every She's single answer. And, her answer and i was like that's yeah. sus looking to me mm. like i get if you have to like look around but it was the same spot always and I was that like, was kind of mm. did you see the candace owens andrew tate interview and he's looking off to the side the whole time he's not looking directly at her it reminds me of that i was gonna say I figured, maybe she, i figured that was because he doesn't like women <laughs> I know, but he was also looking like it, it was it was bizarre too. I mean, I did I notice know. that in their interview, yeah. but I, I figured that was because he didn't respect her and he was refusing Maybe. to look at me. Maybe, yeah. So yeah. a recent video of mine seems to have um, upset members of a certain <laughs> community, and it this um, all the backlash just really made me, you know, just really do a deep dive, like do a soul search. And after all that, I still couldn't find a care. You're going to call us racist. You're going to call us potential Timothy McVeigh's. Fuck you. War. Oh, and she's hot, too. She um, is um, very pleasing to the eye. Mm -hmm. Well, she's definitely found her niche. Let's just put it that way. Like racism is her niche. I don't get it. Yeah, I know. That was thing. my thing. <laughs> I know, man. I, I'm basically gonna take it. I'm sorry, Chrissy. Because while they're out there 
Um, oh, let's protect the dumb animals. Yes, it's a dumb animal. It's a dumb animal. It doesn't have a soul. It's worthless. It doesn't care about. Okay, I don't care about. Who is she talking about? She's men? fake angry. No, not. she's cats don't love us. That's her cats yeah, you, don't love you us. You are video. right about that. Uh, I mean, cat. I have two cats. You know what? I'm always we want right. rule domination. Your cat hates you. Like, I'm stupid. I'm a dumbass. I, I've never said or pretended that I'm smart, but I always get it right because I'm always ahead of the curve, and here's why. I don't do what everybody else is doing. What everybody else is doing is always wrong. They always blindly follow somebody else. They always are blindly following the government. Like everybody who got um, the vaccine, half of them just got it because, no, oh, why not? I don't have wow. to, but everybody else is getting what it. What groundbreaking they got the band and, You know, I'd like to get it too. <laughs> like, are you stupid? Are you dumb? Really? And another thing, like, be original. Like, you want to just do what everybody else does? Oh. How lame. That's so lame. Like, do your own thing. Think critically and, like, be skeptical of everything, especially if it's coming from the government, especially if the... Okay, that is actually her weakest performance because, like, that's, that's very vague. She's not coming across to me as, like, I don't believe her. Like, you know who the OG... COVID is not real people are at this point. And like that take does not come across like Chrissy. I threw the first protest in the country during COVID. Really? Cool. And I got a case all the way up to the Supreme court from Nevada um, about shit. the churches being closed. Like I was all over that. Oh, I don't awesome. remember I mean, that. Like, you do? Yeah. I yeah. was living in Vegas at the time and I was like, heck yeah. Holy cow. Oh. That's a high five. Yeah, that, I organized that. Listen, we were like 12 days into the lockdown. I was like, okay, I'm done. We're protesting. We're getting lawyers. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. I swear. You but weren't anyway, arrested in uh, Portland. It didn't take long. I was. We were all done. I, in, at least in Vegas, we were all pretty over it pretty quickly. <laughs> you I guys would have not lasted in Portland. I'll tell you that right now. That. that shit went on for like <laughs> freaking over a year. We changed our governor. We're the only state that was like, okay, this guy's out. We're getting the Republican yep. and we were done, yep. done. But they ruined yep. Vegas, you know? And yeah. anyways. Uh, it's still Vegas is still tainted. It's still tainted. Hmm. It's it still has a recovery. I mean, hasn't Vegas but... always been tainted? I mean, well, on, yeah, right. but it's, it's a different it's a different I don't know how to explain <laughs> it. It's a different <laughs> kind of tainted now. It okay. has so never recovered. There, there's a canary in a coal mine effect in Vegas because it's like luxury money. Like people can afford to stop traveling there. So we're always the first to get economically mm. hurt. It's like, you know, we're in a downturn when Vegas is doing bad. And then people were escaping Point. California and they had California money. So they bought up our housing market. So then the locals can't yeah. afford the booming yeah. housing. So it's all it's all bad. But um, I mean, it's getting better. But yeah, Vegas has had a hard time with the pandemic and they voted accordingly. Um, but I don't have any angry, like, cool videos that made me popular on the internet about it. I just, you know, did the work to get the case to just the Just said the N-word. Come on, man. <laughs> yeah, I just went to the... I just went the legal <laughs> route and got no credit, but oh, I should have just yelled into my camera. I know. I yeah, know. you gotta be a little racist, and you would have you could have made it. You know. Sorry, guys. <laughs> Sorry, to let everybody down. <laughs> Anyways, I I've, I've had a great time. I'm gonna log off. Oh, Brittany! Oh, thank you so much for coming on. Congrats on your pregnancy. You look congrats, Brittany. I could not tell that you were pregnant from the shoulders up. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> I, I am carrying it a little bit in the face. I so look sad. good from here to here. You don't have pregnant face at all. Yeah. No, no jowls, <laughs> no cankles. Looking great. I appreciate you, and um, we'll hang out another time. It was nice yes. to meet you, ladies, that I haven't met yes, before. Me, you too. You too. Okay. Bye. Hey. Vegas. Love you, Brittany. Bye. 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 Yeah, I would say my take on is, uh, I don't know. I think she's just taking advantage of a moment. It's either taking it? advantage or she's trolling on purpose or both. Because that last video you played, she was like, the way she tossed her weak. hair. It, it was like went, weak. It something looked went like viral. she's cool. trying to, she's posting a bunch of stuff. Something yeah. hit. Something Seeing went little. viral. It's just, it's just what happens when you're a hot young thing. Mm -hmm. You can just make videos all day, nonstop. And one of them will hit, right? Like yeah. eventually. Yeah. 
right? It's just like, yeah, yeah. it's what it's a, um, Dylan Mulvaney did. Dylan character. Mulvaney was trying so many different things, yeah. and then he, he actually started doing um, Day of Non Binary or whatever, but then Day of Girlhood is what stuck, and is that's what, what blew stuck. him up. Yeah. yeah, they're just trying, they're like, we just try, try, try all day. I do TikToks, and then one day. One of them hits and somebody reposts it on Twitter or X and then it's then it's on. Now suddenly you can't, you know. Don't hate yeah. the player, hate the game, guys. I see you in the hate chat. The game. Hate the game. <laughs> she knows she how to play the, the game. game. Yeah. She knows yeah. how. It told me during cheerleading. I was like one of the <laughs> only white girls on my cheerleading squad. And they said they would say, Don't hate the player, hate the game. And they would say, Don't play a hate, participate. And that always stuck with me. <laughs> <laughs> and then they you're say, the only white <laughs> wait you're the, i think i feel like there's a better story you know, here you're the only white one of the few a, yeah and then they would on say a cheerleading no, squad that's impressive flips oh i learned how to step dance uh <laughs> i could if i'm ever in a dire situation and i have to endear myself to the blacks i'll have to start doing my step dancing <laughs> did you grow up in the ghetto Amazing. or like what's <laughs> no long there? island oh. Like <laughs> okay, all right, all right. I went to South Side. It was uh, okay. I don't know if that's a ghetto know. or not, but okay. it was like half. Okay, like maybe it was half. They're they're just Bunch at, of that time, <laughs> at that time. There was a lot. Oh, Ashton's in the back. Ashton, do you want to give your Ashton. two cents on uh, on Miss Lily, the new viral sensation? I have a few things to say as like a former right wing YouTube e thought, whatever you want to call me. And I feel like I kind of see right through her. I just Ooh. all of her all of her videos verbatim sound like old videos Lauren and I would talk about like maybe ten oh, years sad. ago. And She's I wouldn't be surprised. I just wouldn't be surprised if she was watching old 2016 right wing YouTube to get her talking points. Like I, Ooh. I just, I, I'm be, here's the thing with her. It's just think about it. I don't think she had any political opinions before this. I think she just, she said the word, not thinking about it. And then she lost her job, lost her probably oh. social credibility. And now she's gained this whole right wing Trump audience. And she's like, Ooh, I can start making money off of this. Cause I have no job anymore. Like, I wouldn't be surprised if that's the route that she was going is all. A well, what else man are you gonna says, do? Ashton I mean, sees herself. Yeah, it does seem like she's she's taking your guy's thing. Yeah, like I, I just like because when I was going through this whole thing, I remember all I said was, you know, I was surrounded by you know liberal college students when I was in my twenties, and I said, hey, maybe Trump's not a Nazi, and I lost all of my friends, <laughs> my family cut me off completely, and so I have no terrible. community, and so I sort of leaned into the right wing stuff. So like I was doing it for a sense of community. She's probably doing it for money. Who knows? But oh. a, lot of, a lot of what she's doing sounds very like it sounds very forced. Yeah, and she's uh, <laughs> she's blowing up. She's getting on all the podcasts. She's, she's probably going to be a Turning Point USA. That's my guess. Uh, I don't well, know. Good for she's her. Cute. She's cute. So you go. Oh, I want to hear what. She, let's hear her out. Right, but it's not, it's she nothing new. Like, all the talking points are overused. We've heard them a million times, like, since yeah. 2014, 2015. It's a new face. And her That's audience, the right wing, though. It's, yeah. They just they just re recycle stuff all the oh, time. Oh, yeah, like, the thing is, and her audience yeah. knows that it's, it's, it's old talking points, but a new face. And I think that's the thing, is, like, because what happens is, when a, because the thing is, a lot of women in the right wing, are like in a sense like recruited i shouldn't say recruited but like the thing is trafficked not trafficked no <laughs> no but like what happens is they are kind of recruited is there's they a lot recruited. of media producers and whatnot and managers who are mm. always looking for women young women because a prettier face is easier to sell and make money off of right? yeah, clearly duh well it's I mean, just so that it's 90 percent men it's just 90 percent male content creators and so they have to get some women in there and so the women like, make a lot of because i didn't make a dime when i was involved in right-wing media my manager Aww. basically made all of the money off of me and kept it all that's I horrible didn't, i didn't realize what he was doing i so you again, were getting I trafficked you literally were getting you trafficked. Were trafficked. right wing human traffic trafficked for content oh <laughs> trafficked for i mean I <laughs> that's your pimp that, your pimp got all your money i mean you remember on, like literally... i well he told me i was demonetized and i wasn't he was just taking all the money but again Aww. like i wasn't doing it for the Dang. money i was doing it 
I was doing it because, I mean, he controlled my YouTube channel at the time, um, but then he oh, died and I got it back. Um, oh, wow. he died. <laughs> he had a stroke. I so love no, I love the heck? His name was Jeffrey Epstein and he, yeah, actually, right. yeah. <laughs> what the heck? but, um, you know, and the, the thing is like, again, I was, I didn't want, I didn't like care about the money anyway. I mean, I should have, because it would have been a lot of money. Apparently, apparently it's hundreds of thousands of dollars he was taking from me. What? Um, yeah, I had millions of views on some of my videos, like, wow. you know, but um, I was like living in poverty. Like I could have used that money to actually like live a normal life. But anyway, I wasn't doing it for the money anyway. I was just, I was no contact with my family. Yeah, like I was, the game. yeah, but anyway, that's not the point. The point is, is that they love women because a pretty face sells <laughs> stuff better. That's why Fox News, you look at these girls on Fox News, they of all course. look the same. Yeah. I mean, Tommy Lauren, um, who's yeah. that one? Liz, Liz, Liz Wheeler. I mean, Lauren Southern blew up because look at her. I mean, she's very intelligent, but look at her. I mean, she's a freaking bombshell. Mm -hmm. And then when the whole freaking Charlottesville controversy happened, the whole right wing media freaked out. Like, oh, we got to do a PR cleanse. We got to do a PR cleanse. You know, we got to. So basically they were trying to find a new like blonde basically. And that was mm -hmm. me. And I was dumb as rocks. I don't know shit about it still gave but look me at a freaking you now. platform. I know exactly. Now you know dressing as slutty cartoon characters. Yeah, um, <laughs> <laughs> uh, you know. But like the thing is, like I, I'm fully aware of like what happened, and I'm willing to expose it and talk about it. Like I, I'm not gonna sit here and pretend like I was some like political genius. You know, I mean, I said rats in Venezuela is an argument against socialized healthcare. You know, I, I know nothing of. I mean, I'm trying to understand the political world. It's why I don't really have a label for myself, left or right. I, I'm fully aware that I don't know enough. And sometimes I speak more about issues than I should. Um, but I know for a fact, I, I know a grift when I see one. I know when somebody is stretching, mm. trying to make, you know, a name for themselves. I, I understand to make that, that for sure. Yeah. Because stop trying to make fetch happen. It's, <laughs> it's never not going to happen. Yeah. <laughs> you get it interesting so ashton thinks she's full of it and she is just riding the wave and you know right maybe maybe it. along the way she might learn something and, and really do gain a political perspective because that's kind of what happened to me a little bit i learned more about politics oh, yes. in the end she looks very um, political here you know um so maybe she's learning as she goes but i don't think she had any real political opinions before this i i don't um, no, in fact, she, uh, she's she been asked about prior social media presence, so she had, I guess, a Twitter. Um, she did. It was like her all real her name is real Lily, stuff. Lily Coleman, stuff. and then it was deleted, and now she has, yeah. after she got fired, she created all new accounts, blew up, now she's got, you know, almost 100, she's got 119.4k followers on Twitter, so that's one of the reasons why people are kind of sus of her, is these brand new social media accounts, and they're like, well, who were you before? And I guess you Nobody! Well, also, yeah, it was like a pro-Israel yeah. stuff, and now she's hanging out with, like, Sneeko, and, like, these guys that are, like, you know, free Palestine. Well, yeah, because the Charlie Kirk so, type people yeah. aren't gonna associate with her after the N-word. So who's going to associate with her? Who can she Me, get her money I from? Would. Oh. Right, but who who would she get her money from? <laughs> Not you, Chrissy. You can't pay her. No, I can't. I don't know. I'm trying to raise five thousand dollars for Pearl. For Pearl. We need five thousand for Pearl, you guys. Yeah, we can't take it out of the Pearl Fund. Give Come send on. go. No.